New studies show that uh, cilantro is a great agent for helping with convulsions, and these new studies confirm this. We've known this herbally for a long time. Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist, get healthy now. A new study show that you know cilantro is a great agent for seizures, anti-convulsant, and its use goes back 8,000 years. Even the Egyptians used it, and we have new studies showing that it really is uh, something that works. So check this out. See what I have next. If you like what I do, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please tell other people, and let's get those numbers up for me. I appreciate that greatly, uh, and. Also, tell other people, you know, how I can help them to uh, reverse their disease. It's really important. Also, get a copy of my new book, Live a Cancer-Free Life. You know, 10 million more people just came down with cancer this last year. Not good. This is a quick read. You can get it as a paperback copy like this on Amazon, or you can download the Kindle you know, version around the world, anywhere. And if you just Google live a cancer-free life, it will come up. And I have a great rating on Amazon. And it has some wonderful comments, I have to say. And if you want to prevent cancer and lower your chances of having cancer, you really need to get a copy of this. You won't regret it for sure. New studies at the University of California, Irvine, with Dr. Abbott showed that um, parts of cilantro themselves bind with potassium channels in the body that actually help to, you know, help with seizures and convulsions in general in the body. Pretty amazing stuff. Herbalists throughout time have been using cilantro for this type of thing, but now we have confirmation of this, which is really important also. And people have used cilantro for all kinds of things going back 8,000 years, even to the Egyptians which is really important. We have a, a lot of confirmation that it really is helpful that way. And the archeological evidence shows that herbs of different types have been used for over 48,000 years. Wow, just amazing. And helps with, cilantro helps with all kinds of things. You know, cancer, inflammation, it's an antifungal agent, antibacterial agent, helps with pain, helps with the GI tract problems and much more, more, and more. And I have a video and also a, uh, a wonderful little article about it also. And I highly recommend that you eat some cilantro at least a couple times a week. Really important for healing your body in general. Well, if you have some kind of chronic diseases going on, I've lately, I've had people with four or five different things going on and we actually turn all those around and we get them going in the right direction and becoming extremely healthy like me. You know, a couple months I'll be 69 headed towards 70 and I don't look at it and I don't feel it. I'm uh, After doing this, I'm going to go walk my eight to 10 miles and I feel like, uh, you know, a hundred bucks, that's for sure. And you can too. Call me at 831-869- Nine one one nine eight three one eight six nine nine one one nine. Also, remember God. Remember, I love you. And what is your purpose in life? You know, a lot of people say, "Oh, I'm here to help my kids. I'm here to help my grandkids and things like that." Everybody does that type of thing. What gets you up in the morning that you're so excited about? You would do it for free, and you can't wait to get out of bed. That's a whole different thing. And that a lot of people don't have that and are just kind of in the queue, you know, waiting for the end of life. That's not good. You need a purpose. People who have a purpose are healthier and they're more excited about being alive. And I have a purpose. I know what my purpose is. But what is your purpose? You know, maybe it's helping the poor. Maybe it's, uh, you know, going out and working with people who are underprivileged. All kinds of different things. But what rings your bell? You got to find that out. That's really, really important.